Yeah. Yeah. It's a player partner, IQ man, and uh, you see the title. And I know this happened, what, like nine days ago or something like that, but I got to, uh, I know a lot of people probably wouldn't expect me to even be knowing about bruh, you know what I mean? Savage Studios. Um, allegedly, they saying he was shot and killed out um, Yucca Valley out in California. Like, I'm trying to think what's next to Yucca. Is, uh, what's that, hold on, what's, what's next to Yucca County? Or, I don't know if it's a city, but it's a, um, start with a C. Uh, what's that? What's that town? Not Calabasas. God damn it! It's uh, fuck. I'm burnt out, y'all. I'm burnt. But it's I'm, I'm familiar where where he was at. You know what I'm saying? It's outside of like the city of Los Angeles, but it's in, actually it's San Bernardino County. You know what I'm saying? Not San Bernardino, but San Bernardino County. The entire. You know what I'm saying? Um, man, I'm so mad. I can't remember the name of it, but uh. Yeah, yo, back in back in like 2016, I kind of almost forgot about Savage Studios, bro. I seen his name one time, like recently popped up, like maybe probably not recently, probably like a a year ago. I say like a year, a year and a half ago, I seen his name, Brandy, and he reminded me again. I was like, oh yeah, that dude. I remember him from 2016. He was killing on YouTube. Um, I'm probably was sub to him or something back then. You know what I mean? I might be on here. I don't know. Um. But I, I thought he had left YouTube or some. I think he had got arrested or some shit or something like that. And he was going. It was you know he had a lot of controversy with his name and he was talking about his jail. He was like telling story. You know niggas do story times, but he telling saying real names of real people that's not no famous people like regular people. You know what I'm saying? So he was into a whole. He was on some shit, right? So, um, but uh, that wasn't all his content. I don't, I don't even, I, I barely remember, like, you know, but it was there. It was definitely there, you know what I'm saying? Um, but, yeah, man, I just want to say, yeah, I was a fan of him, bro. I almost forgot about just how he looked, of them tattoos. Like, you see him, you're going you gonna, to you, you gonna remember his face, you know what I'm saying? I instantly seen like, oh, that dude, yeah, I forgot about dude, you know what I mean? So, yeah, he was killing it, man, especially me now being in this YouTube shit. You know what I'm saying? I got to pay homage, you know what I'm saying? Um... Yeah, I used to watch his shit, you know what I mean? That was, like, some of the first shit I seen, like, when I came home. Before I went to jail, before I went to prison, it was... Niggas wasn't doing that on YouTube, really. It might have been one person or some shit. It won't... Niggas weren't doing that. And then when I came home, niggas was monetizing it. You know what I mean? Monetizing YouTube, and I remember that. And that's when they had, like... Them YouTube couples was real big, and Queen Naja before she was Queen. Naja, you know what I'm saying? I remember all of like the. I remember that. I remember. I think uh, DJ Academics was like still doing his shit. Like that was OG Academics. Breakfast Club was popping. So yeah, I remember that time, man. That was the time right there. He was one of the like independent personalities. Like now it's a bunch of us. You know what I'm saying? But he was he was one of the real first ones that I seen. That was busting on the YouTube, you know what I'm saying? Pause. You know what I mean? He, he had his shit. He had his page bust. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, man. R.I.P. to that man. He came out of prison. You know, he was trying to change his life. You know what I mean? And end up losing his life. They say they don't really have no details, but he got shot in front of his uh, um, a business he was about to or just started working at. I think they somebody said it was called the Smoking Gun. It was a tattoo shop. I don't know how truthful that is about the name. If you know the name, drop it down in the comments. Uh, but yeah, say nigga, people, nigga pulled up. He told his girl was a fan or something. And then she walked away and just seen him drop on the floor and thought he was joking. It just kind of weird. I seen some his brother was talking about it. Like he proving that he was really his real brother. Had his shirt on. He's like, yo, this is his shirt. I'm gonna put up a picture. With, you know what I mean? I was like, okay, that's his real brother. He got a picture with. He got pictures with him. So it's his real brother. And he's his younger brother. But uh, it's fucked up, man. You know what I'm saying? Got to move. You know, niggas gotta realize, man. When you when you have a notoriety like this is the new technology Instagram that's the new way you can become a star or get you know what I'm saying followings and you know what I mean you don't have to get just signed to a record label you can start your own shit or you feel me so that shit you know you got motherfuckers that see you and shit you know what I'm saying and he had a following you know what I'm saying he had been doing it since back then 
You know what I mean? So he had like 100,000, I believe. I feel like he lost a page or something one time. I'm not sure. But maybe he built it back up. But um, Or maybe he got it back on. Uh, but yeah, R.I.P. Savage Studios, man.